improved on. Oh, I wasn't really paying attention to like what he could, what, how he was playing. I was just looking for the big hits and going, woo! <laughs> But I'll be paying attention to this set because I'm commentating. Alright. Game 1. Jaws? Xyphonaut. This is going to be really cool. Yeah. J both, like, technically, like, just like, fiending. Grumbly! Fiending low PR ah. players. You think? Like, nearly, like, nearly at that. I think Xyphonaut is on PR. Currently. Isn't it? What wins it, yeah? No, but like recently. No, Not like the last HM. PR. What was HM. the last PR? Was it HM. HM? Well, they're both fiending for PR, these two. I feel. Well... I don't know if they quite have the results. Oh, so this is the same matchup as but me like, and Finn. I haven't like looked at the results, so. Oh, he saw me do what he'd like to do that. <laughs> He's been influenced. I think Zyphonor, um, is... Probably confirmed HM at this point. Oh, 100%. He yeah, had such a good week. Yeah. Um, I don't know about PR there. I mean, who else is on the PR at the moment? Well, like, it'd be like Lanoon, Jace, myself. How has Lanoon been to event this season? Yeah, yes. Who, which one? He's been to like two or three. That doesn't count Not PR. Not even counting interceptors. Yeah, which ones? What? Were they both? Were they all at the start of he the season? He went to like a QT smash, if not two of them. Was this? Has he been to a tournament after Bam? I don't know, but Bam's not the start of the season. No, but it's the end of the season. If you don't go to a tournament, if you don't go to the tournament, the first three events of the season it doesn't count. Well, the criteria is different every uh, every PR. Because we need to have a unified PR rule set. Yeah, definitely. We'll have that fixed up for Smash Ultimate. Sure, he's dead. Dead man. Four oh, combo, not gonna work. Going high. F smash. That must have been a missed input. Surely, you're not waiting long enough to react to the di on that bouncing fish. Combo, nearly get the bouncing fish. Pulling ahead of this lead. Oof. <laughs> but definitely, um, oh, wow. Marth can do it. Could Marth have been the comeback. Zyphnor, pretty, yeah, nice. um, pretty decent lead that he has right now. Yeah, Sheik's good at this. Sheik's good at uh, taking a first stock. And then just carrying it. I feel like you, you want to see a chart of Sheik. Like, if Sheik doesn't take the first stock, Sheik generally like struggling to win. Yeah, definitely. Like, regardless of matchup, almost. Without just missing these hits. Oh. Wow. That was that was <laughs> immense. That was actually the best like bait situation I've seen like <laughs> from these two. No, that was nuts. Oh, that was nice. Yeah, that good DI mix up. up. DI cross up. No, but that was so hype because you just think he's gonna go to the ledge, so Sheik's getting ready for an edge guard or like a, a ledge rex up and he's just gonna nap. So, that was really nice bait. Fling. The best kind of baits are the ones that go into kills. <laughs> it's the deadly bait. Do you call that the mouse trap? I don't know why it would be called the mouse trap. I feel like F Smash is more of a mouse trap. They kill. They're baits that kill. Oh, I see what you mean. And the Venus slide trap's already taken. <laughs> I mean, a Slide Trap isn't even a bait, though. <laughs> <laughs> or is you, it? You can bait it, maybe. But, like, it's not really... It's the move itself that's called the Venus Slide nah. Trap. Nah. Alright. Jaws really gonna have to, like, do better in the early game. Ooh. Nice! Oh. oh, Nearly got the MK, Leo. That wouldn't have killed, surely. It wouldn't have killed, but it would have fucking hurt. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Oh Keep going for that. He, 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 he keeps it. almost getting it. I feel like Zyphon should just chase up the air then. Yes, good tech chase. Oh. Uh, I feel like he could have got that bouncing fish if he jumped out. Oh, oh my Ooh, that could have been a stock. They're both thirsty for the stock. Alright, this is looking good for Bo. 
Oh, I'm gonna kill. I think um, Joel's had that where if he just dropped yeah, down with the, with the forward air, I think he had that. Oh my. Nearly. Yep, needles. They'll work. I like what um, Dyknor does, which you should do too, is with his nares, he fades them back. Like on ledge, he jump, nair, and fade back. And hopefully, the, um, the, the, the soft hit the hits, and then it leaves. I like the thing that Moid um, does. But you're gonna, get, does. you're gonna be getting the sweet spot nares to kill. I like the thing that Void does, that's a nice kill. The thing that Void does, where he jumps off the stage and jumps back on over there. Yeah. I feel like that is a good situational because then you can react if they do something weird. Yeah. Alright, definitely not out of the realms of possibility for Joe's right now. Yeah, 100%. Apart from his back kill, that'll be a good road. Just doing a good uh, job at keeping up the pressure even though with the stock deficit. Uh, but it looks like Zyphonos is turning this around. If he normal gets it again, I was going to say. It's the no mix up mix up. I don't know why he's air dodging immediately out of all these combos. Like, she can't follow up after an up air. Don't air dodge immediately after an up air. Yeah, it's similar with like, Samus nice. combos. Good little... Like, Sheik's want you to air dodge. They always want the air dodge. Um, same with like, Samus. Where a lot of people like, nice. they get dash attacked and then they air dodge. That's what makes like... That's Samus gonna be a SD. Oh. A SD. A SD. That's the SD. Yep, good bait. On the Tomahawk. Oh. I don't think that back air was worth going for. I don't think even if he hit it, he hasn't got anything out of it. Nah. He's got stage control. Alright, what's he going to do? Worked out from there. Oh, it worked out because it, it didn't hit. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah. I feel like that should have been something else. Oh. It's definitely not out of the realm of possibility for Jaws. This needs a good little tip. Another 14%? Oh, is that it? Nah, he's living. Nah, you he might know, have a jump he knows his he knows. Not gonna kill. Wow. Nah, still living. Still gonna jump. Oh, I didn't have a jump. <laughs> All right, we're gonna game three. Oof. Sent your email. Yeah, sent your email. What was the score? All right. Well, maybe you invited us to your party. We're gonna see a combo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be a nice little side B. Who sends invites over email? Shameful. I thought you were in business, sir. That's how you only receive your invites from now on. <laughs> yeah, but birthday parties? Yes. Or non-business... Wait, wait, wait. ...related birthday parties? No, when you're in business, every event's business. I know, right. Okay. Struggling to get off this ledge. Silly. I just don't think Jaws is reacting enough. He's just throwing out all things. Going for reads. Crimson saying to play Mewtwo, you goose. Absolute. Not gonna kill. Absolute. Well, it's uh, definitely possible. Against? Did Luka just get sponsored? Did he? Hawaii Oi. Esports. Sponsored by who? Is it by the same people who sponsored Kami just last week? Who? Queensland's Melee. Give me a proper sponsor. Give me a big sponsor. Big one that I've heard of. Oh, it's DMG, DMG. For sure. Or is it that one that keeps Justice Esports? Never heard of them, but I'm sure they'll make a big. I, I really want that to be like a, a bunch of oh, esports. I know Justice Esports. What yeah. are they? Well, I don't know if I can say. <laughs> okay, but don't say anything. Yeah, yeah. But I really want there to be like esport brands that in Australian Smash that we can know. Yeah. That we can start making rivalries. Dark side. Like, you want like TSN, like TSN versus C9 kind of rivalry. Yeah, yeah. That's what, that's what makes the, that's what, it's, it's, oh, Oof, that was neat. That was neat. nice. Very nice. So I have no one for the neutral get up as well, which was the safest uh, option to go for in general, but it kind of, um, it fit him. 
Yeah, but it's, it's okay to have um, these Smash uh, players being sponsored by companies that aren't exactly like massive brands. As long as they can keep, the g they add more to the game than just their name. Yeah. Oh, like no, I feel like I feel like Dark Sided. Yeah, I feel like Dark Sided um actually does a really well with like constantly promoting Nick. Yeah. Um, yeah, constantly definitely. like including themselves, like trying to put themselves into the community, trying to reply to people, etc. Yeah, like, that's 